Hi, I'm Josiah Clark, and I'm the youth pastor here at Calvary Chapel of Gloucester County. Uh, this morning, I just wanted to tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, I grew up in a Christian home. Uh, my dad's Pastor Gary, the senior pastor here. And, uh, you know, I was a typical PK, I guess, uh, a preacher's kid, if you don't know what a PK is. Um, and, and I was a PK in the sense that uh, I, I was a very rebellious child, um, rebellious all the way through my teen years. And um, for the most part, that rebellion was pretty well hidden. Um, but when I was in my senior year of high school and I was trying to decide what I wanted to do um, for college or for the rest of my life or for anything, like any senior in high school is trying to figure out, um, my parents suggested that I go to Bible college. Um, and I, I knew of the Bible college in Marietta, California, uh, that Calvary Chapel had, um, and I really didn't want to go there. Um, I, I had no desire to do that. Um, but I started looking at other Calvary Chapel Bible colleges, and there were schools all over the world. And I really wanted to travel. That was really my heart's desire. Um, and it was neat. There was a Bible college in York, England. And I was, I was and still am a huge soccer fan. Um, I watched the Premier League every Saturday morning. Um, and there was a Bible college less than an hour away from my favorite team um, in England. And so I decided I was going to go to Bible college in, in York, England. Um, and I, I left, I took the plane, I, I went across, um, and as I was in Bible college, um, the very first month that I was there, uh, I fell in love with the Lord. You know, I, I don't know um, exactly when I got saved in that time, there wasn't an exact um, moment, but at some point, uh, it clicked, it made sense, uh, I, I got it, I, I understood um, God's grace, I understood that He loved me, and I loved Him. Um, my first true worship experience was in that time. It was really an amazing time. Um, and not only was it an amazing time for um, getting to know the Lord, but I also met my wife uh, that first week of Bible college. It was funny. We were at orientation um, the first Monday that I was there. And, uh, and while we were there, we were standing next to each other in line because we had uh, last names that were close to each other. So I asked her what her name was, and it was Aaron Clark. Um, so when we got married, all she had to do was drop the E at the end of Clark um, to become Aaron Clark, I guess. <laughs> um, but that's a little bit about myself. Uh, my last semester of Bible college, uh, I was trying to figure out what I was going to do afterwards. I was in Santa Barbara, California for my last semester. Um, and while I was there, I was talking to um, my now wife, Erin, on the phone. And she suggested, um, why don't you talk to your dad about uh, coming and working for the church? I've had a heart for youth um, for a really long time, and all the way through Bible college, God has really given me a heart. Um, every semester that I was in Bible college, I worked with youth in some form or another. Um, and so uh, I did. I called him and said, uh, you know, this is my heart. This is where um, I think that God's leading me. And so he hired me on um, after I graduated Bible college in 2016. Uh, I wasn't immediately the youth pastor. I, I started working with the youth um, along with Tim Porter, who was, who was then in charge of the youth group. Um, and I started doing whatever else the church needed. I started working um, with the video ministry. Um, I, I still help out some with that. Uh, I started doing some cleaning stuff around the church. It was funny, all through high school, um, I cleaned bathrooms and, and everything else here. Um, and eventually, as I was working in the youth ministry, I started doing more with the junior high. I started teaching every week. Um, and eventually I was asked to be the youth pastor here at Calvary Chapel of Gloucester County. Um, and so I've been the youth pastor now for almost two years. Um, and I've lo absolutely loved it. I love working with kids, um, with teens. I work with students all the way from sixth grade through 12th grade. Um, and it, it's really um, just an amazing, uh, amazing job. I, I love my job. Um, one of my favorite things about my job is that I get to be creative through it, um, whether that is uh, like getting a new building and um, getting to design that and come up with ideas for that. Or um, I play guitar, so getting to play on Sunday mornings with electric guitar, getting to do um, video ministry stuff, uh, you know, all these different ways that I get to be creative. And one of my uh, favorite ways that I get to be creative um, is through teaching the Word of God. And every week uh, on Sunday mornings and on Wednesday nights, um, I get to teach the teens. Um, and, and honestly, it's one of my favorite things. We go through the Bible um, verse by verse and book by book. We don't go um, in necessarily in order, um, as we probably should. Um, but we go verse by verse and we go through different books of the Bible. And 
um, it really is just an absolutely um, an amazing job and I love it.